Savage Finance. Because it's a jungle out there that wants your money. Here I will teach you how to manage the jungle and make it out. Even millionaires need budgets. Today we're going to talk about how you can create a supreme budget and I'm going to give you a system and a process on how to properly handle your money so you will be set up for financial success. This is a very hard time for many people right now and hopefully this message will read those people because in the future you can be better financially positioned you can start to have more money. If this is your first time here, there's two things I want you to do. I want you to go to the front of the channel and begin to watch the older content. Just toggle that video button and begin watching videos from the beginning to the up to that to now. And also I want you to go over to hustlers, Kung Fu life skills. The link is below and get your free course 30 days to 2,500. This is a course that's going to teach you how to set up a side business because over half of America has an income problem. And this is a course that will help you get your foundational business education. I know the things that I'm about to say in this video will sound implausible. They will sound strange. They will sound impossible. They will sound un that something that the average person will not be able to do. And I'm going to preface that with this story. In 1997, I was homeless. In 1997, I lost my job. In 1997, I wrecked my car. I had absolutely no money. I had debt, I had obligations, and I was going through a divorce. That was my position. That's where this story started. So I was able to come out of that hold and understand that many of you may be in a similar situation right now because of this pandemic. And I'm here to tell you, if you put your head down, you focus and you work hard, you can get out of it. I got out of it. You can get out of it. The first part of this as advocated on Savage Finance is that you have two emergency funds. You have your long-term emergency fund you have your short-term emergency fund. Now, once you get those two things fully funded, you're going to keep those robust saving habits that you've developed, and you're gonna open up your operating account. Let me explain to you how this happened to me because this is evidence and a byproduct of the do more principle. Remember when I told you guys that I had a job and then I started my business and I made more money? This is where this generated because at the time, you know, I had a new BMW, which I had paid cash for. I was, I had me a little girlfriend. We used to take all these trips and I found myself in a position to be able to pay all of my bills, regardless of their due date at the first of the month. I would pay my rent. I would pay my credit cards. I would pay my insurance. I would pay my child support. My ex really loved that because I would just go ahead and pay my child support for the month at the first. And I would write on the check because you have to be specific on these things. This is my child support for the month of and just give her a check. And also, this is what happens for you to get to this level. You're going to have to make more money. Let's be honest, because, you know, there's some of you who are in a position where you're making six figures and you mismanage your money. You just need to get a better grip on your money. But for the average American, and this is why I'm giving you 30 days to 2,500 to get you started, you need to make more money so you can start playing this game. Because what I found out when my checking account got to $200,000, that I was able to pay my bills at the first of the month. I didn't have to wait until I got money to pay my bills. I was able to pay all of my bills early, even to this day. I pay my bills early. I don't wait until the due date. I set a date that I like that I pay my bills. And also part of that for me is I don't have that many bills. I don't have car payments. I don't have credit card payments. I don't have student loan debt. I have virtually no debt. So that makes it real easy for me to practice this. And we'll get into that into further conversations. But once you get your two, emergency funds and then you get your operating account set up 
This is going to change your financial life. This is going to change how you live, how you move. It's going to change everything because for me, it changed everything. And remember, I used to be homeless. You can't get any more ass out than that. So for, I know there are many of you, you've been programmed and conditioned to be indoctrinated in the great American credit in indoctrination. You've been indoctrinated. I mean, you know, it's just inconceivable for you to pay cash for a car. It's inconceivable for you to pay cash for a house. And you got to expand your mindset. You've got to open up your mindset. Once you get this stuff deployed, then this opens up the door for you to go to the next level. Do you understand that you have a long-term emergency fund? You have a short-term emergency fund. You have an operating account that has, because let's get into how you're going to set up this operating account. You're going to take all of your bills. You're going to write them down. You're going to add them up and you're going to set a target to save two months of your current bills. And this money's going to go in your operating account. And then at the first of the month, once you have this account fully funded, you're going to sit down and write out all your bills. You're going to pay all of your bills early. Once you do this, this sets the foundation for you to become wealthy. This sets the foundation for you to become rich. Why? Because you have good money habits. You're managing your money correctly. And also I'm about to share a secret with you that many people don't know because they spend most of their time in a state of financial lack. Money, money attracts, attracts money. money. Right now I have physical cash money on me. I have credit cards with no balance. I have cash money in the bank. I have two PayPal accounts with money in them and a Stripe account with money. So I have money currently in six places. Now, what does this do? If you are a person that can never get to the point where you have financial surplus, you'll never experience this. When you have money, it attracts more money. I just told you something that well, should be, you should be hooping and hollering, clapping and praising your hands to Jesus. When you have money, it attracts more money. Like literally today I was supposed to be off cause now I'm taking like off days and I made money today doing absolutely nothing. I was just around my house puttering around. I had someone come down and cut down a tree. That's been the events of the day. So when you have money, it, it brings more money into your life. It is amazing because I, I understood this and this goes back to those early lessons when I set up my business while I had a job following the do more principle, I would be deals would come out of nowhere because I didn't need money. I had money, money. And we're about to get a little spiritual here. Money is energy. If you have spiritual energy of money in possession, that will draw more money to you. And most folks never will find, this is what I found out because I was working hard on my job, making money. I was able to pay cash for a car with, with my job money. Then I started my side business. And once again, I did not do less. I did more. I was working my job and I was selling this furniture for these other people. All of a sudden I started, my deals got easier. My deals, because I remember when I looked in my bank account, the first time I saw $200,000 in my account with my name on it, it made me so confident but it was a relaxed confidence because I would sit down with the clients. I would talk to them because I was trying to solve their problems because I had money. I wasn't pressed. It was amazing that deals that used to be difficult, I start closing them left and right because money begets money. This is why rich people get richer because they already have money. This is why multimillionaires become billionaires because they're already positioned to have money. And if you go ahead and get your long-term emergency fund, your short-term emergency fund and your opera, your operating account funded, you set the stage for you to become wealthy. Now, why is this? Remember I'm giving you 30 days to 2,500. I should tell you that some people, one guy who took this course, he had a business, he was making $20,000 a month. 
After taking the course, he went up to $100,000 a month. It's a powerful course. Don't just download it because it's free. Download it and go through the course and do the work. It will change your life. Because like as I said, America, much of America has an income problem. And as we're seeing with this pandemic, this thing that's going on right now, that people are starving. And this is why these stimulus check videos are so popular because people are looking for financial relief. And I want you to be in a position where you don't need no damn stimulus check. I want you to be in a position where you are good because during the good times, you were stacking your, your acorns, you were putting your acorns in the tree and you, you got your long-term emergency fund, you got your short-term emergency fund, and you got your family operating account. Something else, if you want to take your finances to the next level, go ahead and get my money management course. The link is below. This is going to teach you how to position your money because many people, and I'm going to be a little, maybe a little confusing here, so hopefully you can follow me. If you make a certain income level, you have an income problem. And there's much talk out here. It isn't how much money you have, it's what you do with it. I feel that that is untrue. Because if you're making $25,000 and you live in Atlanta or New York, you're struggling. You have an income problem. You know, even if you manage your pennies to the best of your abilities, there's not a lot of pennies to go around. So you need to make more money. And this is one of the reasons that I, I built this channel because I feel that America's ready for savage finance. The personal finance channel is very different because I'm gonna teach you how to make money as well as how to manage it and how to grow it. A big part of this whole situation is that people have very bad financial habits and habits. And this is why you set yourself up to become wealthy by having these three accounts fully funded. And let's talk about, you know, there are many people up here that talk about savers or losers. You know how long you would have to leave this money in the bank before you start to lose money? Like 15 years, 15, 20 years. And what, as we go along, I'm going to tell you where to put this money and what to do with this money so it can grow and you don't lose it. But you want to have cash money, cash money on hand. You want to have cash money in all three of these accounts. 50 million Americans just had their credit card limits reduced or cut off. And there are many people who are using credit as their emergency fund. And now they're looking there and it ain't there. It's not available. So I want you to have cash money in the bank. I want you to keep your job and I want you to start a side business and I want you to generate more money in your life because this is what happened to me when I saw the power of doing more. It literally changed my life. When I had money and I saw how it attracted more money, it was crazy because right now there's a lot of stuff on YouTube that is what I call poverty mindset education. There's all of these hacks, there's all of these shortcuts, there's all of these ways to cheat your way into real estate or start a business or to get funding. And also, here's another big lesson that many folks will not tell you. Every day I get someone that's like emails me and says, look, I got 10, 20, 30, $40,000. What business should I start? And what I tell them is to take your money, put it in the bank and start a side business or a hustle business for the least cost amount because my first YouTube channel, which has been responsible for millions of dollars, it cost me $285 to start and I did not reinvest into it for two years. So why would you wanna do that? If your business, you can start your business and you can start making a profit, that validates your business ideal. But if you have a business where you have to throw all of this money at it to keep it going, that's a very bad business. You should be able to make money, you should be able to make a profit, you should be able to generate income. And that validates and vets your business concept because there are many things here on YouTube that are very bad businesses, like Shopify dropshipping. If you do not know how to run ads, it's a very bad business. It's a very bad business. But we will get into that later because once again, I'm gonna teach you guys how to start businesses, how to make money, how to manage money, and how to grow wealth. And this is the preliminary foundation for you to get rich because as you fund these three accounts, you're going to develop amazing financial habits. And also, once you start doing this, 
be quiet about the amount of money you have because many folks will not be living like you. They will not be making the decisions. They will not be making the choices that you're making. They won't be doing what you are doing. So make your moves in silence. You may have a close friend or two that you can tell and educate and by all means educate your children on this because financial and eating habits are developed in childhood. So you can set your kids up for life. And actually you should go through 30 days to $2,500 with your children if you have them. You can learn together. It would be a wonderful family experience. But this is what's going to set you up where you begin to financially change your whole life and begin to live and begin to enjoy life. So that's all I've got for you. Be sure to go ahead, go to the beginning of the channel and watch all of the videos from start to finish so you can get your financial education. Be sure to get 30 days to 2500 and if you want to level up, be sure to get my money management course because it's going to teach you how to segment your money and how to set things up properly. And oh yeah, be sure to watch this next video that's right here. It's going to be good for you. It's going to be good for you.